Celebrity chef Jose Garces has some great restaurants in Philadelphia, and making sure the menu items are just right starts in his test kitchen. Our own Victoria Woodall found out more about the decision-making process. When dining out, there's nothing quite as tantalizing than cracking open a menu to see what makes you salivate. And you're not the only one hoping for that reaction. That moment as an artist, it's like instant gratification. For Iron Chef Jose Garces, creating menus to wow his diners for each of his 12 restaurants requires a dedicated test kitchen, weekly tastings, and the experience of his culinary staff to interpret the ingredient or concept he has on his mind. It's challenging because again, you give me direction and I try and I'm like, all right, I think this is what it's supposed to be. Like, I think I got it. And then I'm like, here, chef, what do you think? He's like, this is not what I was thinking. Um, why don't we try again? So. What's that moment like in the test kitchen when you found it? Does everyone just like their eyes just go bug eyed and like freak out? We know when we're all aligned and when it's good. And then and then again, there's those moments where we're like looking at each other like, that really sucked. That's no good. <laughs> they're working on two versions of a Spanish style ratatouille dish to add to the summer menu of Amada, Jose Spanish Tapas style restaurant. Ratatouille has eggplant and it has roast peppers. Uh, Pisto manchego is zucchini, summer zucchini, fresh tomatoes. While one has a bubbling gratin style top and more tomato, the other has a blooming view of hand rolled cured zucchini and salsa verde but only one will make it on the menu. What's your decision? Can you turn around? Sure. <laughs> I love it. That I know it's a favorite. test kitchen and uh -huh. we're all supposed to be honest, but you've got the Iron Chef and his incredible team. The man. The man yes. and his team presenting right. two dishes that are both so stellar. How do you pick? You right, right. I know. But I did. Yes, you and did. And the one that I picked had a cheese like uh, Manchego cheese, like au oh. gratin vibe to oh, it. Stop. Mm. However, that's Stomach not the one scrying. they picked. They right. picked the lighter version, so you can find that version at Amada. <laughs> but talk about an incredible behind the scenes experience. Yes. When you got to around. taste something that is not on the menu. There you go. And Very now nice. it is. Hello. Hello. Always. Thank you, Tori. You got it, guys. Be Thank right you. back.